Hi folks, I needed to clear my head and uh, decided to take off the afternoon today and went to the Lake Valley Retro Labs. Uh, intention was to work on the next release of uh, QLE, but then I changed my mind and uh, started to clean the desktop and uh, workbench. And uh, yeah, at the Sinclair QL computer here, I installed the brand new QL VGA module from Marcel Kilgus. And this is a very nice module, like produce a crystal clear picture on the VGA monitor, such as this 15 inch uh, ISO I have here. It's really crystal clear. And uh, QL is running QLE, last official edition. That's version 3.19 from uh, spring 2019. And uh, this QL German edition is installed with uh, QLSD, the one with the micro SD card. And it also has Quimi installed and uh, a nice mouse. And uh, the mouse pad here shows a drawing made by Rick Dickinson for the next QL. Uh, drawings he made uh, before he started to design the ZX Spectrum next. Okay. Ooh. Let's move on. Then on the test bench uh, I have a, a workhorse QL. It's a D16 build. UK made, it's a late serial number uh, with issue 7 motherboard. It has installed uh, QLSD, the original version produced by Paul in Germany and it uses the latest firmware, that means latest Minerva uh, with German keyboard and messages plus uh, QLSD driver 1.09, the latest 2020 edition from Marcel. Okay, the QL is a bit special. Uh, it has no top case uh, mounted. The keyboard is an external one. It comes from a Sinclair QL German edition. Those had a, a bit better keyboard in, in the feeling and it has installed a brand new keyboard membrane. So this is a very nice system also for typing. And the reason why the micro drive section is cut off is because the QL this keyboard came from was used uh, approximately 30 years ago when I produced a batch of the so-called executor uh, QL compatible systems and uh, the QL uh, which this keyboard was mounted on, was mounted into a tower case and uh, it included a, a twin micro drive in the PC tower case. That's why I had to cut it off here. Also on the table are uh, quite a few QL expansions uh, for the expansion port. And uh, I use this to try out several software environments and to test QLE. And you will find quite uh, rare beasts like uh, the 68K OS cards in various uh, versions. That means with various firmware and operating systems. Then from uh, Cambridge System Technology, quite a bunch of hardware, including uh, their RAM Plus module in two versions. Uh, their uh, SCSI and floppy disk controller or just their floppy disk controller standalone or the parallel port interface. Also quite old uh, RAM modules from uh, Quest. Then a uh, lineup of uh, gold cards and super gold cards from Miracle Systems. Then Cube IDE. Then the Tetroid disk interface or uh, the QL ROM disk. Also, here, very nice Sandy Super Cool Q board, latest edition with mouse port. Um, this one can nicely be operated with this mouse here. It's perfectly compatible. 
Here we have a 128K memory expansion from Sinclair Research. This was never sold to public, but a few dozens or a few hundred were produced for developers and in-house use. The Sinclair sold floppy disk uh, controller by uh, Micro Peripherals Limited and uh, Tony Tebby's uh, QEP3 EEPROM programmer. Quite a bunch of QL expansion cards here on the table and uh, the QL with QLSD is uh, running QLE also latest edition, same version as on the other QL. It's nicely uh, running on a 640k RAM machine. It leaves you 72 kilobyte free because it's uh, quite intelligent and when there's not uh, that much memory, it loads less modules. And on the back here, I have a QTalk speech synthesizer and uh, Tandata Q communication stack, which is also here for tests. Okay, that was just a, a short overview on my uh, workbench, desktop, and uh, everything has been cleaned this afternoon and a fresh setup to uh, also clean my head from work and uh, other troubles, and uh, I'm looking forward to enjoy the summertime and uh, in case it's rainy one day I might come back and continue development and on the next version of uh, QLE. That's it for now. Take care, stay tuned and all the best. Bye.